Hi guys. Right, see now I've got a spare um, hour or so, I'm going to crack on and start getting more of the car stripped so that it's going to be more or less a bare shell. So let's crack on with that. damage to the air vent area around here. You can see it's been bodged in the past with some um, fiberglass filler there. Um, and uh, we'll need to obviously renew that section of metal there. Because we just can't have that. I mean that'll let water into the car and it also upsets the integrity of the of the structure of the car as well. Um, you expect to find these things in an old car like that and I'm not going to go slagging off um, previous owners for doing bodge repairs like this because ultimately it's because of these bodge repairs that's been done in the past it's effectively kept the car on the road. So um, we really need to thank them for that you know because had that these repairs not been done the car probably would have been scrapped years ago, you know. So, no, there's no point slagging off other people's work that's been done in the past. Because if it wasn't for their work, like I say, the car wouldn't be here today. It would probably have been scrapped and be a tin of beans or something now. You know. But if you look at the other side, you'll see that the other side's actually pretty good. Get some light on the subject. The other side's pretty good, the paint's hardly even disturbed. So anyway, I'll just crack on, onwards and upwards.
as you can see that's the speedo out of the car now dash more or less stripped the vents at each side and these ones here I'll need to chisel them, them off the screws are really rotten at the back you know that'll clean up the screws when I take the wings off and then I can pop them out but as for the, the, the harness going into the car you can see there that's like blue tack. Sorry for the shakiness, we'll get a bit closer. Right, there we go. Not shaking now. Right, that's like blue tack, so it's obviously been used as a sealant of some sort because it, it's got a blue tacky feel. It's not putty because I think putty would be a bit of hard by now. Um, but it's certainly done its job. Because the shelf in here is, is, is perfect, except for one little area here. A little bit of rust there. Um, so we'll address that when we get to it. And this side here. That is quite bad. But that'll be getting changed. Well, that'll wrap it up for this video, and again, thanks for watching.